Hello everyone, and welcome back to another Star Wars Fair Room. Um, i got quite a few fairs to share tonight, so uh, we'll just get started right away with the first one, which is this guy here. Clone Pilot Oddball, from Wave 2 of the Clone Wars. Now this is basically just a repaint, um, and re of the head of the Clone Trooper, and you got Oddball. Uh, as you can see, his head is or symbolizing that of the pilot, the standard Republic pilot, and then he comes with a clean armor and a clean DC-15, and then he came with a clean version of the uh, rocket launcher all, pretty much all the clones come with, uh, from the Clone Wars, and the packaging I got right here for him, looks pretty cool, I like the picture up here, um, in the bag, I'll just quickly read to you from the back here. Uh, clone pilot Oddball, who receives his nickname during advanced training, has participated in many significant missions in the Clone Wars. Oddball is a starfighter pilot trained in flying B-19 Torch starfighters, R-170 fighters, and other standard Republic fighters. So, that's pilot Oddball for you. Um, as I said, he's a repaint of the uh, clone trooper, actually, so he comes with the same articulation, which means Ball joint neck, ball and shoulders, ball and elbows, one swivel for uh, wrist side, and one ball hinge wrist, which is kind of quite interesting. Um, a ball hinge torso, uh, sorry, ball, ball jointed torso, uh, swivel hips, ball hinged knees, and ball hinged ankles. This is pretty much as good as it gets. Um, what I love them to add uh, this uh, ball hinged uh, wrist here to uh, the other wrist as well. Can't see why they can do that. But uh, it's pretty good. Uh, the head can't be taken off unless you just want to display this white ball. There's no face sculpt on there. Um, this little pad here, a part here. It's a bit flimsy and can be removed as you can see easily. Thought about gluing it in place instead, but I'm not too keen on doing that yet. So, this is helpful for you. Uh, I'm pretty glad they released this one because the uh, original episode 2 clone pilot f um, back from, what was that, 2003, something like that, 2002, can't remember exactly. Uh, it's kind of real, kind of hard to get now, but nowadays, um, and when you can find them, it's like the price of two figures, three figures sometimes. So I'm glad they decided to release a uh, figure that can also be used as a generic uh, clone pilot. So, this was a lot of both for you. I hope you enjoyed this, and until the next time, may the force be with you all.